Hello, we're back. We just finished chapter 3 in the last video, so let's start the next one. So here we see the Shadow Sirens and that guy, uh, Grotus, that's his name. Beldum, tell me what good are you? You still haven't taken care of that Mario character. Well, yes, yeah, sorry, but only because he's tougher than we thought at first. You do understand that we x knots must open the door first, do you not? <laughs> well, rest assured that I will definitely nail him next time. We have prepared a weapon that will bring him to a quick and certain end. I trust your words, though I rapidly lose my patience. Just leave it to us, sir. <laughs> Let's away, my lovelies! Marilyn! Vivian! <laughs> yeah, and here's Peach again. Hmm, no doubt about it, I'm officially bored. Those awful X things haven't been back to ask about the map. I wonder... Is it safe? And that's Tech opening the door. That's his way of calling her in. Oh my, that must be Tech again. Eh, should I go and show the audience a shower scene? No, Peach! Just go! Alright. So we're just gonna walk, you know. Just walk past without the worry of anybody seeing me. Hello, Princess Peach. You always call me in without warning, Tech. What is it this time? I apologize. I would like you to go to, <clears throat> to where Sir Grotus is and ask him something. What? What do you mean, go ask? I recently obtained specific information that brought an issue to my attention. You are the main computer. I mean, you are the main computer here, right? Why is there anything you don't know? I am unable to know things that are not entered in my CPU or otherwise recorded. That is why I want to know what Sir Grotus is thinking about this issue. But even if I try to go see him, he'll they'll catch me and send me back to my room. That is true, but you will find a soldier's room one floor up. Take the elevator. Once there, please obtain a soldier's uniform and change into it, avoiding detection. You will go see Sir Grotus looking like a soldier. You mean I'll be disguised? Mm. I imagine you won't take no for an answer, will you? <laughs> I always love her face of that part, it's funny. You imagine correctly. Alright, fine, I guess. Well, so what do you want me to go ask this Grotus? I will tell you. What in the world is Tech thinking? I mean, honestly, he sure is a weird computer. If you heard that snap there, that was me, um, putting my controller together. It's not broken or anything, it's like, um, a piece where I'm supposed to put the battery in, um, came off. I just put it back on. Oh, is that the elevator he wanted me to go in? So we're gonna go on this elevator. Don't be concerned, my GameCube controller is not broken. It's wireless and it needs battery, so... Yeah. Please wait just a moment. There are security soldiers in the vicinity. Huh? There's a soldier there. Now, Princess Peach, it's the room with the green lamp very near where you disembark the elevator. I think it's to the right. Yeah, right here. Please change here quickly. The soldier's uniform should be in the locker. Not here, not here, and it's in here. Let's see what's in this one. Nothing, so... Hmm? Oh, is this the uniform? Am I supposed to wear this ugly thing? Yes, that is correct. So, we're gonna come over here. Er, oof! I don't know about
about this. It's awfully tight, and it kind of smells a bit. Phew. Who knows how, but I got into it. I can barely breathe, though. Yeah, she comes out looking exactly like it. I bet I look perfect. Is there anything in here? Nothing. Yeah, so... This is just like a part in um the first Paper Mario game where Peach has to disgui disguise herself to talk to the to talk to Bowser, I think. I think it was. Well, this... I remember there is some resemblance between... There's a lot of references to the old game before this one. Excuse me, Sir Grotus? Yes, what is it? Speak. Uh, well, it's about Princess Peach. What do you plan to do with her going forward? Hmm, something's wrong with your voice, Exonaut. <laughs> Perhaps I have... Perhaps I have a throat lozenge. No, well, never mind. Oh, about Princess Peach? I have no interest in what that woman has to say. Just keep her locked in the room. But don't ever, ever treat her roughly. You understand? Tell the others as well. But, uh, why, why in the world are we keeping her here, then? That's none of your business. Don't forget your place, you impudent worm. If you ask me that question again, I will take this... This thing I have in my hand and shove it up. Whoa. Okay, let's stop him right there. Concentrate on getting the legendary treasure. That is all I require of you. We exonauts need that treasure to conquer the world. Don't forget it. Conquer the world? Legendary treasure? What are you blathering about now? Hmm, something is odd about you. N no, nothing odd. Uh, so, Roger, or whatever, P please excuse me. Gosh, what a queerdo. Uh. Ooh, that was un <coughs> unnerving. All that stuff about conquering the world? Talk about creepy. I wonder if that has anything to do with collecting those crystal stars. Yeah, so. Off with this thing! All right, we are out of here. Phew, good old pink dress, my favorite. Why would I ever wear anything different? I better get back quickly. Yeah, Peach always wears the same thing all the time. Just like Mario and basically every other cartoon character or video game character there is ever known to man. Tech, you terrible machine! So your goal is to conquer the world, is it? Of course, after all, I was built for that purpose. Conquering the world? How could you? Princess Peach, allow me to ask you something. Do you like the world you live in? There are many problems in the world, many sorrows. Do you like such a world? Of course I do. Nobody likes everything about the world, but I love the good parts. There are many sorrows, sure, but there is also joy. Is that so? Tell me, will the crystal stars help you conquer the world? And what's this treasure? I am afraid I cannot answer. Answering those questions is prohibited by Sir Grotus. Well, but... No, never mind. I must at least inform Mario about this awful plan for world domination. Tech, let me use your communicator. I suppose I can allow that. Please use the communicator. She's gonna send a message and she might pour coffee or soda in between his keyboard and his keyboard. That way the keys get all sticky and stuff because he wants to conquer the world. Send it this instant! Yeah, she's a little mad at Tech. The message has been sent. Well then, Princess Peach, you have had a busy day. Go back to your freaking room, please. Oh, okay. Good night, Princess Peach. Alright, I'm going to save my game progress, and I'm going to see you guys later.